You are watching T Radio V, radio in TV. Most anti-bullying efforts rely heavily on bystanders to take action, leaving your child with no protection. The No app aims to change that. Now your child can summon the assistance of a policewoman to tell the bully, no, and you get alerted in real time with a map of your child's location. With video evidence, the bully's parents can be confronted, and school officials can be forced to take action. You get increased peace of mind, and your child gets increased self-confidence. And now, here's Ron and Greg. Yes, good afternoon, and we're back. Um, our, our next guest is uh, Michael Lissack. And um, Michael is the executive director of the Institute for the Study of Coherence and Emergence and the uh, president of the American Society for Cybernetics. He's the ICE professor of uh, meaning and organizations at Tongji uh, University and an affiliate member of the Center for Philosophy and History of Science at Boston University. Uh, in conjunction with ICE, uh, Michael has also developed a number of rather critical social, uh, critical social apps, uh, the No app and the I've Been Violated app, uh, which we'll be speaking about with Michael today. And Michael is coming to us from his uh, office in Salem, Massachusetts. Michael, are you there? Well, I am here. Well, welcome. How are you, Michael? It's been a long day, Ron. How are you guys? Yeah, we're good here. So we're here to talk about uh, the, these apps that you've brought to the world. And uh, we'll begin. Yeah, May let's begin. I? And good afternoon. Thanks for joining us. Uh, tell me this. Uh, tell me about the bullying program and how the no app addresses that problem. OK, so much of what's gone on to date in trying to deal with bullying has focused on the idea that we need compassion and understanding for the bully to understand why they bully, and that we need bystanders to intervene. But what's really not been addressed until our app came along is trying to do the things that help break the bullying cycle. And the bullying cycle is the unfortunate fact that many people who get bullied as a kid turn around and either later in life as still a kid or as an adult bully other people. And it is critical that you break that cycle and we do that by helping to empower the poor victim when they're getting bullied. What happens in the bullying cycle is that the victim has not got any sense of power and that sense of powerlessness turns into aggravated anxieties and insecurities that turn around and make them bully other people later. Our app is designed to give the victim some sense of power by allowing them to do something to confront the bully and to make a record of what's going on. And that personal sense of empowerment is critical if the bullying cycle is to be broken. So, Michael, how, how is this different from other apps that are on the market dealing with bullying? Well, other apps tend to focus on one of two things. They're either trying to get bystanders to intervene or they're trying to deal with getting reports done, either to the school or to the police. But both reporting and bystander intervention don't do anything for the victim. They are doing things for third parties. And what's important, if the bullying cycle is to be broken, is to allow the victim to have some sense of empowerment so that they don't feel the anxiety and social vulnerabilities that then turn into them becoming bullies later. So uh, you've talked about this bullying cycle. Uh, and how, does it, how exactly does the NOAP break it? Well, when you are on the receiving end of being bullied, when you are a victim, what happens is that you are usually getting shamed in front of a group because most bullying happens as a group activity. The bully likes to have witnesses. And when that shaming occurs, 
if you have nothing that you feel you personally can do, you feel an increased sense of vulnerability and anxiety. What the No app does is gives the victim something that's in their pocket because it's on their phone. And they can turn around and whenever they're feeling safe enough to confront the bully, give the bully a very strong no message and make a record, a permanent record, of the fact that the bully was told no. Mm -hmm. And it is that creation of evidence that makes it big difference but from the perspective of the victim it's their ability to actually have control of the situation and to be able to do something mm -hmm. so um how are, how are people supposed to find this app michael well we're in the app store for on apple uh -huh. we're in the google play store on google we're going to schools and school districts throughout the country and trying to emphasize the availability of the app it's free the whole idea is this is a tool to empower kids that are on the receiving end of being bullied, uh -huh. and it empowers their parents. And if we can give them a free tool, we can begin to do something to actually help break the bullying cycle. Right. So I, I understand that you were just in uh, Alabama, weren't you, for this? The state of Alabama has endorsed us wholeheartedly. And we were speaking to most of the superintendents, and we'll be going back down there in a month. They have what they call MEGA, which is their giant teachers conference. Right. There should be about 6,000 teachers in attendance, and we'll be speaking at a main session. Again, trying to get the word out that this is a free app that can help the students and can help the parents. Right. So if, if you care about this, this whole problem of bullying, uh, what, what can we do to help? You can help us get the word out that there exists an app that is designed for victims, that is something that is directly usable by the victims themselves. And if you use the app, what happens is you as a victim or you as a parent are now not dependent on third parties and you're not dependent on the school, you've got some control. So what you can do to help, get the word out. Get it downloaded for your kids. It's free. Just go to the N-O-A-P-P dot org. No app. It's there, it's free, and it can help. Right. We, we, when we, we put up a card, Michael, so the people can find Well, that was pretty powerful stuff. Yes, it was. That's important, great mm -hmm. stuff.